Hello everybody, what's going on? Jerome here and welcome back to our awesome episode of Shell Shock Live. And in today's episode, we're going to be using our items, specifically the EMP Blast, in order to unlock EMP Blast level 2. Now when we did this with Shield, we couldn't really discern any difference at all with it. It didn't last longer, it wasn't more powerful. Uh, I don't know, I'm hoping EMP level 2 has some kind of an upgrade to it, otherwise I'll be kind of... A little bit disappointed, but, you know, I guess that is what happens sometimes. You're not always going to get what you want. But either way, we're going to start off this game. We're doing some simple 2v2s in the meantime. And, really quick before we get into this video, the first thing is... Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Please land and play. 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 It's not going to land and play. Okay. Well, either way, everybody, uh, one big, big thing is that I, I want to know, do you all want to see more shell shock, but in live stream form? Now, I started live streaming my Minecraft channel, and I actually kind of like it. I did it the other day. I'm probably going to do one today as well. It'll be in a couple hours from when this video is uploaded. Uh, and I was thinking about it, and I'm like, Shell Shock would be kind of like a really, really cool game to live stream. And I, I just want to know, like, is that something you all would want to see? Like, w would people watch that? Would they... I don't know. I mean, just, just let me know. Comment down below. Is that something you'd be interested in? And if it is, then I might as well get on it because that'd be a lot of fun, honestly. I, I would be very, very pumped to do something like that. So click that like button as well if you're enjoying, and let's get into this thing. So now that we've damaged them a little bit, I'm going to go ahead and use our EMP Blast. I don't know. I probably got to... Yeah, I got to wait until my next turn. So next turn, we're going to be using the EMP Blast here. Uh, oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Cat! Dang, that person's got a lock with that cat. That's so bad for us. I'm going to use minions on this attack, and now EMP Blast as well. We'll use the EMP Blast right there on them. There we go. So, that's level 1 EMP Blast. My assumption is that maybe it'll have a bigger AoE if you EMP Blast, like, let's say, like... Yeah, I I'm assuming it'll just have a bigger AoE, because I'm kind of... Oh my gosh, are you serious? One minion hit him? That's all? Well, I don't know. My, my two assumptions are, one, that it'll be a bigger area of effect, or two, that the EMP will last longer, like more turns, instead of like lasting one or two turns, maybe last three to four. I, I don't know, like we're, we're all in the dark here as well. Uh, I know I was disappointed with the shield one, but you know, we'll see. Hopefully I'm not going to be disappointed with this as well. Oh jeez. That could have been really bad if somehow we managed to hit that two times bonus and then do damage to us. Alright, so I'm going to keep on moving like this. Get it on up there. And hopefully we'll be able to hit this person with something here that's actually decent. Let's try and use Bolt. Let me see if I can hit the guy in the back a little bit. Here we go. So I changed our trajectory by one little tick to aim it towards the guy in the back. Perfect shot. Shazam! As Alex would say. Big ol' Shazam. And I think now it's probably better if I was to move this webcam to that corner. There we go. See, we always got to be dynamic with where we put our webcam. Got to keep moving it, depending on how the map changes a bit here and there. Okay. Oh, geez. Well, I think we might be in a position where we can just... We might be able to get this thing and the two times damage. I don't know for sure, but this might be a thing. And if that's the case, what do I want to use in this guy? I mean, try need. Let's just try it. I mean, I mean, it might bounce out of there, but if it doesn't, this trinade might potentially just kill this person. So let's just go for it. Mini turret, secret blade, twenty-five. Okay. Oh my gosh. No way. The placement couldn't have been better. The placement literally couldn't have been better for two times damage, and we picked up the care package. That's fine. That's fine. You win some, you lose some with it. But definitely a little bit on the disappointing side, because that literally, like I said, it could not have been better. Um, so if we don't lose the trajectory we're at right now, we can spot her this person, hopefully do like 100 some odd damage. And Master of Fish will hopefully be able to kill best, be I thought I said beast mode, but it's best mode, best mode pretty soon. Oh, that's absurd! He completely missed that shot. Like, completely and utterly missed it. That's absurd that it still managed to hit me anyway. Um, alright, let's try and do, let's do mini turret. Mini turret will probably land in there. Because mini turret kind of spreads out a little bit and has, you know, shoots the bullets a little bit around. So I'm kind of not too worried about it. So let's see if mini turret will land in there and do some good old solid damage for us. Um, and then hopefully next turn we can move back in a position where we're locked on and maybe take some uh, sparklers to him. Why well, think I just shoot kittens straight in the air instead of directly at the guy? There we go. 60. Wow. Okay, then, that was really, really good. All right, we're doing it. 
We're doing big bad man things. We have to use EMP Blast one more time, by the way, and then it'll be level two. So it's uh, we have four uses on it already, I'm pretty sure, from a previous video. So we'll sh we should be good to go. Uh, oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. It's going to be bad. It's going to be bad. Miss, miss. Yes! A couple big misses there. Um, and here we go. Let's go ahead and drop that in there. Uh, thanks, dude. But should be good. Because he offered to help me out there. And I don't really think I necessarily need the help. I don't think I'm going to kill him this turn. But I think we should be alright regardless. Alright. He just goes nasty. Two times damage. Sweeper. Good hit for that guy on our team. Oh my god. Toast is literally barely alive. He's just barely alive. So anything at this point is probably going to kill him. I could even earthquake him to do damage to the other guy. But I don't, I don't want to, you know, do that to him. Uh... Nah, I got luck on him. But not beast. So yeah, it's beneficial if he was to go after a beast guy. He said K. And literally, I don't know why the game just gave us so much stuff. But, I mean, okay then. I wonder... Wait a minute, I have an idea. I wonder if I can just go ahead, do a two times damage, right? Now hear me out here. What if I did that? And what if I dropped sunflower in as well? So here's my assumption. Maybe I'll be able to two times damage and hit both of them. Nope. Okay. Well, I completely missed that. At least at least Toast is going to die. So that's always good. Oh my gosh. Yeah, Toast is going to die. Okay. Yeah. Oh, I tried for something better. At least I accomplished what my initial task was. So that's always good. Um, let's see if we can hit this guy. What is magical? I don't know what magical shower is. I'm going to do it. But I have no idea. So just, I'm sorry if this attack missed. I've never heard of this attack before. Oh, geez. Um, well, we can't really move much more than that without hitting that. So let's just, let's just hope it's got a good AoE to it. I'm just kind of curious, you know, but I want to see. I want to see what it does. And this is probably the last turn because Master of Fish might have, oh, he doesn't. What the heck? What the heck? Apparently it just wins you the game. That's exactly, <laughs> what the, what? is that like a better seagulls? I guess it's a better sequels. I don't know. But that was round one. Everybody keep clicking that like button if you enjoyed and commenting down below about the live streaming thing. And apart from that, we'll be back with round two, my friends. All right, everybody. We're heading into the second round here where we're hopefully going to figure out how this is going. Uh, so let's see what we can do here. This will level us up to level two, which is very fortunate for us. So I'm going to go ahead and... On our turn, probably use EMP Blast. As long as we have a lock, I'm going to use EMP Blast so they can't move. And I'm just going to keep on abusing that because I am cheeky like that. No, that's, that's actually the smart way to use EMP Blast. You wait for, you know, to get a lock and then you just keep on spamming it. And you're pretty much all good. All right, there we go. Uh, and what should we do here? Okay, well, that completely disrupts, like, any of our attacks. Um, I'm going to go ahead and just... I can't even drop a dead weight. actually. I literally can't even drop... Whoa, we gotta be creative here with this one, then, because we don't really have a choice in the matter. I'm gonna... I guess if I shoot stone directly, that might bounce over to him. Let's see. Oh, jeez! Well, at least our guy just landed a huge nuke on them. Come on, bounce back and hit him. No. Unfortunately, that stone was not able to do it. That was our best attempt we could do. Nice nuke, though. That was actually sick. That was really cool to see. Uh, you rarely ever see someone who has nuke. Uh, uh, let's see. What can we do here? I could... Uh, I wish they were still bunched up. If they just bunched together, I could have EMP blasted both of them. But now I can't! But that's fine. I'll just pick on EMP blasting one of them as soon as I get the decent enough lock. Uh, okay, look! They both ended up missing! That's good. Hey! And he hit himself with that! Jeez, this team, I just kind of feel bad for them at this point. Uh, Alright, let's go ahead and we'll use a driller. Let's try and use driller here. Let's see. Oh my gosh! Literally like one more tick upward and that would have hit. I don't think I shot another nuke, but it turned out to be a clover. I was like, how many nukes has this guy got in there? How many can it fit in that machine? Um... All right, well, let's go ahead. Oh, he's moving closer to our, our zone that we have. He's moving closer to it. Uh, maybe I'll, I'm going to use... I'm going to use Bounce Blow next turn, I think. Oh, my gosh. If he hits himself again, 
I thought that guy was gonna hit himself again. I was like, there's no way he's just gonna two times in a row hit himself like that. All right, here we go. Bounce float. This will really help us gauge where we're shooting, hopefully. And, and even if we miss, it'll probably end up hitting someone anyway. Perfect. So we pretty much have the lock that we want now. Oh my gosh. Oh no! He nuked himself! No! Why? Why nuke yourself? I mean, I know he didn't mean to, but why? Oh, this guy. This guy is in the perfect position. We just lower our aim down one. We should be able to builder him. And then if we... Actually, if we do one, maybe we could even just sniper him. Nah, let's not risk it. Let's do builder. Let's do builder, and then let's do EMP blast. Hopefully stop him. Uh, so there we go. Come on, come on. I think what, what are they doing? I think they're strategizing this time. Well, hopefully they end up hitting themselves again. That'd be nice. Nice way to do it. Oh, okay. Oh my gosh, another fireworks. I feel bad for my guy in the front line there. He's got nowhere to run. Oh my gosh. EMP blast. Right on him. Drop down builder. Two times damage. I kind of want to drop it down twice. I'm going to drop it down twice here. Yes! And a good call to drop it down twice. Except that it only wants to hit him. Oh! Ah! What? What just happened? His double bounder moved him into the builder. What? Okay. I like EMP Blast now. Even though I didn't even really get to use it because he died and didn't get to move anyway. But it's the thought that counts, right? It's always just the thought that counts. Now, what's a good attack to follow up with here? Because I have completely lost my angle and everything. Let's just shoot it right there. Let's see if this will work here. Fighter Jets. Ah, there we go. That was definitely a good move to use. Oh, and Mini V took care of the front of his cover, so now we just have a direct shot at him. We could probably shoot, like, up here and just nail him. Don't make me get my ruler. But why, right, dude? Don't use a ruler. Um, I'm gonna dead weight. I'm gonna drop a good old dead weight on this guy, at least guaranteeing 25 damage. It's not the worst thing in the world, considering he doesn't have much health left. I'd just rather be constantly doing damage to him and keeping him on the ropes, you know? Alright, there we go. And plus, now we can actually start to test some things. Let's shoot it. Let's see where an attack right there will go. I'm assuming that that'll probably be, like, right here-ish by the time it deadweights. Oh, a little bit below it. That was close, though. And what's this? Oh, no. Oh, no. Nice hit, buddy. Nice hit. Um, So this guy, he's barely got any health left. I mean, we could pretty much just do anything. He's dead. Might just torpedoes just to get a good AoE, kind of a good spread. Actually, a spread more so than an AoE. A good spread. Um, that way, pretty much ensuring that we hit this guy. So let's do it. Here we go. Hopefully using torpedoes to get a good spread. Will it work? Will it not? We'll find out in a second here. And, oh my god, they all missed. They pretty much all completely missed. Great. Great. Uh oh mad birds, mad birds, mad birds. He's gonna miss. And he completely just lost that one. All right, let's do, let's try dual roller out. I'm kind of curious how this one's gonna work. All right, I think, I think we'll be all right. I think dual roller pretty much will guarantee us the kill here, but we'll try it out anyway. See what happens. All right, hits there, breaks in two, and dual ruler or roller it is. So thank you all for watching, and we'll be right back with the final round where we get to use EMP Blast level two. And just so you guys can see it upgrade real quick right here. Uh, let's see, at the end of this, do to do to do getting through all the XP. Oh, we unlocked Double Bounce Float as well, that's pretty cool. Boom, shagalaka, Double Bounce Float is now mine. What else we got here? And here it is. And upgraded EMP Blast. All right, everybody, so we're heading into the final round here. I'm gonna probably try and use the EMP Blast towards the beginning of the round, uh, preferably just that way we can pretty much ensure that we'll get to see if it lasts longer or anything like that, because if we do it towards the middle and the person ends up dying, then how are we ever to know really what it does? You know, I just make it sense here. Oh, we got the brand new weapon, Shockwave. That's pretty cool, actually. Never seen that one. I haven't used it yet, anyway. 
uh, effectively, that is. Shockwave's a brand new weapon, once again. Uh, for all you Shell Shock enthusiasts, it just came out, and pretty much it just shoots a big old Shockwave around your entire body, dealing damage. I've never had the pleasure of actually hitting anyone with it, but, you know, it's it's cool. I've only gotten it once. Well, I got it twice. Only got to use it once, didn't know what it was, and used it on no one. It was kind of very sad. Uh, either way, though, let's go ahead, and you know what we'll do here? Let's go ahead and let's EMP Blast this guy. So here we go. This is a level 2. By the look of it, it looks like the EMP Blast is a little bit bigger. So I'm guessing that's what it does. It seems like maybe it just covers a bigger area. Uh, hopefully it lasts longer too, but we'll see in a second here. Did Dead Riser miss? Is that even possible? How does Dead Riser even miss? It goes underground and straight up into the person. What am I missing here? What 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 am I possibly missing here? Oh well. Well, we'll get the person next round. At least our teammate got a nuke to use on them, so can't really complain in that regard. But yeah, now we're about to see. So by the looks of it, it looks like the EMP blast is a little bigger, so it can cover more ground. And we're about to find out and see if it lasts any longer or not. Let's see. So it's been one whole turn. So he's been EMP'd for one turn now. Now we're going to use Bounder as well to help gauge this next shot on him. Let's see. Oh, he's got Travelers. He's using Travelers on this guy. And wow, did we ever miss that shot. Oh my gosh. I would have been so upset if Bounder messed up after Dead Riser messed up. I would have literally lost it. I'd have been like, this game's busted. Uh, okay. Uh, can you take out Jival next turn? There we go. So hopefully we'll be able to take out Jival. Oh, if he doesn't die. If he doesn't die, there we go. He didn't die. And now we can spend our time going after Ra- What? What is with this guy? He, he literally- Like, I, I've i never seen luck quite like his. It just- He just keeps getting ridiculous amounts of cover over his head. Oh my gosh. Well, that's a surefire way to kill someone. Good kill, buddy. Nice use of your trains. Oh my gosh. This guy. Oh, everything's going on in this pit here. I don't know what's going on there, but he's just always got something surrounding him. Let's use Tadpoles next turn. And then we also have Bouquet as well that we can use to really just bring it on to him. So there we go. Tadpoles. And even that, he's still got a boundary. I guarantee at least one or two of my Tadpoles to stop by that. All right. And oh, that two times. I don't know how. I guess actually... One of my things might straggle and hit that. Or one of this guy's if they explode properly. Oh my gosh, almost all of them were sent back with that boundary there. This guy is so ridiculously lucky with the boundaries that he gets spawning above his head. It's absurd. Is there something I'm not getting here? Even when he's shooting, he gets those things as well. Am I missing something here? Maybe? Alright, oh no. Oh no, don't kill him. Yes, he's still alive. Still alive, but barely. Oh my gosh. A proper bouquet land right here. Well, two times... That'll kill him. If this does everything properly by the books, this person is dead. Oh, come on. No, it missed. But at least we did 12 damage, I guess. I could use kittens on this person to deal a little bit more. Kittens will do some good damage to him. Or a snake. Snake could potentially kill him. But I'm going to use snake. Because I think that has a better chance of killing him. All right, here we go, Rozzy. What do you want to do? What do you want to do to us, buddy? Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Rainbow, 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 rainbow. And a swing and a miss from Rozzy. All right, let's go ahead and we'll drop, hopefully, a good old snake right on his head from right here. Let's see. Okay. Well, that's going to be a big attack regardless. And a snake takes him out. And that, my friends, is gonna do it. So that right there was the upgraded EMP Blast. I hope you all enjoyed this video. If you did, then click that like button. Be sure to subscribe, and we'll see you next time, friends.